Maybe if we grant the Sparkfly 1-1, one, one, we'd still be one off. We were always one off lethal. As always, thank you to Mastering Runeterra for sponsoring this video. Make sure to check them out for meta tier lists, daily articles, and you can use code SNUI for 10% off subscriptions. All links are down below. He would have survived. I wanted to, I mean, it doesn't matter because they're still overall damage, so it, Tarek would have one less health, which means we'd still be at exactly the same. It literally would have been the exact same outcome. Terrible things lay inside. Voice from <laughs> when will you ignore with all regions? I have to do Kane, Jax, and Jin first. Rune Terror Champions first, but we'll get to that pretty soon. That's gonna that's gonna be something we're gonna do fairly uh fairly soon. Got more stars than years. Got a lot of years. This is a cool concept for a deck though. I like it. Weapon roulette. Yeah, go ahead and block. Oh, done. Should have done it. I mean, this this loses. Uh... <sighs> no, we have to do it. it. It loses to the the four mana furious wielder. I think it's called that strikes us. Yeah, that one. I mean, yeah, it is what it is, right? It is what it is. It would have been really good if we got that through, but it is what it is. Oh sure, I'll take another Jax. Wanna line up for your beat downs or go all at once? Seeing tombs, towns, and everything in between. I think we're still yeah, we're buffing Jax, right? Candy takers, keep it moving, team. Yeah, let's buff Jax. Yeah, they, they spent a lot of mana for that kill, so the fact we drew another Jax off the top was pretty good. Then again, Jax's weapon is one mana, we could have also put it on Tarek, and then made like, a pretty similar play. This deck is pretty fun. They reveal my name and grovel before mine. So they kill the goat? What if we just do this? Or they kill this, actually. We do this, we get the pot of pain every time. Uh, we could have made the survive, but the rake is just better. Serve me. Yep, thank you. Okay. Might have had to, uh, to develop first. To have pill active? I don't think it matters. Good people don't look the other way. What's the punish here? I don't think there is one. I think we're just chilling. Shatter them. Weapon roulette. Does that mean we buff the goat? Let me change up my style. Now let's buff up Jax. Unyielding. Hug it out. To slaughter. There's nothing they can have for three mana, right? Yeah, there isn't. Noise. All right, three HP. Let's see if we can pull this one through. So far, this deck doesn't feel too bad. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. Justice was fucked. I think it's uh, probably gonna be close to the Sparkle Fly finish. L listen, this is why it loses are important, okay? You can have a sweet game, but eventually you need a way to close out the game. Yesterday we played Tarek Orn, and as soon as our Tarek died, as soon as our important unit died, we had nothing. 
With, with this spark of flying with Esmus, we actually have a way to push it through, and that feels really good. I, I know elusive cringe and all, but you know, having an actual win con in your deck, not that cringe. That's pretty good. This is the one I was hoping for. What's for dinner? Oh, I uh, spilled tonight's stew in our last battle. Oops. It's only question. The guy from PZ that copies himself with whatever buff he has when he hits Nexus. Would that happen with equipment as well or no? No, it, I don't think that happens with equipment. I don't think so. We do the passing here. Sick. Everyone should have a grappling hook. That should uh, pretty much be their interaction, though. Ready to go round. Oh, that's awkward. This is a cultist, so it draws a cane. <laughs> that's pretty funny, actually. I, I didn't consider that. <laughs> Wait, that's really cool. I didn't think about that at all. This is justice. Mortality is madness! <laughs> Fixing the world one scoundrel at a time! Cane passive is actually good. Yeah, it's actually quite good. Cane uh, is just super consistent. Cane as a champion is not that powerful, but the fact you can draw him consistently and the fact that his, his car package is crazy good is, uh, is, 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 is insane. It makes Cane a playable champion. <laughs> Alright, GG. <laughs> Yeah, that's why, uh, that's why I like the Elusive, because when you play a Taric deck, opponent does everything to remove the unit you're buffing up, and then you still have a way to finish the game. It feels strong. That feels powerful. That's important. What if Jax have, when you equip three equipments, draw me? I mean, if Jax does, like, the same thing where you draw him for free, like, like Kane, that makes Kane less special. It would be kind of lame, I think. I don't think they should do that. I was, I was, uh, proposing these buffs, because, like I said, I'm working on a scripted video, and... I'm not gonna try to do any any like um, <laughs> like garage balancing like just super scuff because I'm not a dev so all these changes take them with a grain of salt. But I think for example, if, if Jax had like when you've equipped five times, five plus times, grant equipment everywhere plus one plus zero. Same with Evelyn. Once you've summoned X amount of husks. Um, give Huss everywhere plus one plus zero. I think that would be cool. So this gives uh, this gives plus two plus two, right? Wait. Oh, that's so good. See, people were telling me that this didn't work that way. People were telling me that you can't have double support or something, and I believe them because I'm an idiot. And I'm naive and gullible, but it just straight up works. Awesome. Each life. Okay, don't you don't have a yeti. You didn't top deck your yeti. You sh okay, well this sucks because abominable, right? Oh no, Chad. Oh no. Alright, it wouldn't have mattered. Hope you stretched. Please no triple abominable. I don't ask for much. I really don't ask for much. Come on. Ah. Uh. All right, only one. Keep it moving, team. To protect all. Never okay. And this deck is pretty pog. I like this deck. Quite a bit. Bloody business. We can we can protect Jax. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. That's the good stuff. Yeah. Bob. 
A thousand years of battle and I'm just... <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Alright, we're, we're, we're right. We're in there. We're in there. So we just need to not die. Th this is actually lethal if we don't block. Okay. Only the finest serve. Alright, give me give me a good weapon for Tarek so we can block with this. Yeah, we'll take that. Think you can fish up something to eat after this battle? Catch and release only. Do you kill everyone you beat? Fish meat face. Please don't kill my Tarek. Please. Oh god. Okay. Oh, that works. All right, cool. That's good stuff. That is the good stuff. And we get to play you. Alright, so high roll is something to target Tarek, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, that should work. That should work just fine. Let's see how that works out. Oh, oh, this deck is beautiful. Look at that. Yo. Oh my god. Shepard targets Tarek. Yeah, I, I meant mostly a spell to copy with Tarek so we could pass it on to Jax. But that that was clean, man. That was a clean win. Sheesh. Need better removal for a loser? Yeah, good good luck with that. In, in a Jax Targon region. <laughs> I can, you can't... I mean, okay, Hush is a thing. We could honestly also play like the, the Moonlight Affliction. Moonlight Affliction would not be the worst, but I don't think it'd be good. It's possible. I have my orders. Uh, come out from your shadows, demon! In position behind you. Yeah, I think Moonlight might be uh might be the play. Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, I've never met anyone like you. Okay. <laughs> Reporting in. One more one drop. For down the road. Interesting. Okay, I mean, Sparklefly is literally game over. Okay, wait, we just have to find Sparklefly and we win. No pray, no pay. I mean, the goat dies here, right? Five two. Never submit. Say your farewell. I don't know if I should have kept mana. I think we're dead. We, we need Sparkle Fly next turn or it's over. Okay. If we don't die this turn, it's winnable. The mountain endures. I mean, this is like... We're dead to decimate. If we do this, the next turn, I think we have to do this. Lost in reflection. I can't. It sucks, but we just have to hope we're not dead yet next turn. If they have fervor or decimate, we're dead. I simply cannot play around it. It's so likely to have it because all they've played is units. You know, they have two cards, so. Let's see. You got it or you don't. Unyielding. To preserve beauty 
and protect all life. Okay. A second Tarek would be good, so we could have buffed that. Like, the, keeping that first Tarek alive with, with anything like, uh... Oh, it just takes it. That makes sense. Ugh, okay. Here we go. That's good. Are we alive? I mean, 3 HP is the same as 4 more or less, because I can't... I could have played this for one more health to play around further, but if they had it... They would have probably used it, like, during the attack, right? Okay. Alright, well, here we go. Now it actually matters that I didn't play this. Because now we're dead to the top deck fervor. That was bad. I should have just played it then. I should have thought ahead. That was not that was not good, Chad. That could lose us the game, actually. Oh, okay, we won. No, that not playing catch there was bad. Because if they had fervor, I basically need to be at four health so I could beat a fervor top deck next turn. That's actually true. That's uh we learning, we learning. What is your opinion on new champions? I think they are not as good as the last one. Yeah, it's gonna be pretty hard to beat <laughs> Kai'Sa. It might be Agra has not had an amazing record. And Agra has been amazing in this game. Agra has been really good, but not in like the past six months because we, we went to like uninteractive things. It's like, oh, you can play Agro and hopefully kill me at turn five, but on the other side, I'm playing Thralls and I'm gonna play a, a Blighted Ravine and also have like four 8-8s on turn five. So, you know, if you can beat that, good for you. If you can't, well, I guess you'll lose. Those are horrible options. Is Nora too slow? She's not too slow, she's just not good. <laughs> People complain about it, but aggro and LORs they usually suck more than not. I don't know. I don't think in 2020, 2021 that was the case. I mean, it depends on what you define as aggro, because it can be a little bit vague in this game. I, I like the combat real a lot here. Combat real is uh, quite good for the Tarek. So you're... Damn. Okay, do we beat that with combat real? I think we do, right? Yeah, we do. Six. Okay. Don't worry. I am here. I shall need my tools. <laughs> okay. I think it's an interesting discussion. It's actually something I want to dive into. Uh, just just figuring out how good or bad aggro has been in the history of LOR. But overall, I think it's been... Pretty good. It, like, the last six months, it's been bad, though. So, yeah. It might have even been more than six months. <laughs> Alright. That's cute. So Tarek is at 5. <laughs> Wait, that is actually... Target. Target. Support. 3. Okay, wait, hold on. So you play Tarek, you play a spell on Tarek, that's 1 target. You support with Tarek, that's 2. Tarek copies the spell, that's 3. So if you just buff Tarek and you support 1 unit, you're always at 3 out of 7, right? So with this, we're at 5 out of 7. Yeah, that makes sense. So this does count for 2. Am I missing something? You target Tarek is one. Tarek supports unit is two. Tarek copies the spell on, on the unit is three. Why do I why do I feel like you're always at four out of seven when you play Tarek? 
You use lure? I did. I mean... No, I know. I Listen, that, but that's the thing, though. Then this doesn't count for level up, does it? Because this turn, last turn we played Tarek, we played the Lodestone, it's, it should be one. The Lodestone should be one. Now, we went into the next turn, we played the Lure here is two. We used Pill Casket on Tarek is three. We supported with Tarek, four. Lodestone buffed is five. Am I missing something? For Acacia! And you know what? Also for me! Wanna line up for your beatdowns or go all at Alright, I, I, I have never been very good at math. I might need to <laughs> open like a notepad for this afterwards. It's five? Yeah, I guess. Why do I feel like it's been more? Weird. Opponent was pretending to be AFK. I see. <laughs> Tarek Jackson, the man, you know it. What's up, 40 second? I did one Yordle portal and suddenly Jogby means nothing. Shatter that. <laughs> yeah, we don't have to, right? Pots for boiling! Well, leveling Tarek is pretty good. We have another one in hand. Yeah, let's level Tarek. So you're dead, probably. This combat really is so good because now we can also use the Counter Strike, right? Do I want this back? I think this is fine. To preserve beauty and protect all life. Yeah, this is literally timeline the expansion so far. Oh wait, we could have actually saved that then. No, then this would be dead. It doesn't matter. Nah, it doesn't matter. This is always dead. Alright, but you're gonna wanna block with this here, Ezreal. It's one off. Right? It's one off with this, because this gives Jack plus one plus one. Bonus on nine. Runate? We beat Runation. The same calling card from our other case. Is Jax good? Yeah, Jax is good. Jax is better than I expected. You're playing Discord? Does this like ever play Harazi? Yeah, it, it can. It can play Harazi later in the game. It doesn't really need to though. Wait, we're at six. Wait, that's actually scary. We didn't draw a single elusive. Oh god, we could lose here. Yeah, we might lose. Uh, this is we're at four HP. It depends on what uh what they find. Okay, doesn't matter. Okay, that makes me feel good. All right, opponent not killing us. Pretty good. I was a little bit worried that those spells were all gonna go to Nexus and then we'd be dead to burn. But uh, that, that's cool, this is cool, this works for me. All right, here we go, chat. Yo, I, I love these darkens, man. It feels so freaking cool when you get to play them. I love it. <laughs> Look at her. Sick. I don't kill me. Don't kill me from six. Don't do it. 
meme deck or actual deck, I'd say this deck is playable. It's it's not the best deck at all, but it's sweet. Courtesy to uh, Chaotic Effect for sending the concept of this deck. Double get excited? <laughs> Don't... Okay. <laughs> Alright, GG. <laughs> Thank God. Thinking outside the box, Zillion Victor, Time Bomb Printer, One Two Pop, Meta Shifter, Not a Quitter, Fighting for LPP, Snoop.